So besides Ida, we have a lot of other things we are watching here in the tropics. Of course, Ida came on shore as a Cat 4 hurricane, still impacting the central Gulf Coast tonight, overnight, in through tomorrow, and really into the next few days. It's going to be impacting the southeast and then the northeastern U.S. for the end of the week. So, of course, that has our main attention, but we can't take our eyes off the tropics because we have some other systems to watch. We have our latest tropical storm, which is Julian. We also have Tropical Depression 10, which will likely be our next name storm and then we have a disturbance off the east coast it's not too much to worry about we only have about a 10 percent chance of it developing in the next five days but this one coming across the western portion of africa it hasn't even made it into the eastern atlantic yet it is expected to be a very strong you can see how well developed it is and it's over the deserts here of western africa that's going to come into the eastern atlantic and it's expected to have a really good chance of developing into our next uh, named tropical system after TD10 and that will be an 80% chance of that developing the next five days. So it is rare that they put out an 80% chance before it's even over the water. So that is really something to consider here. So there is our latest tropical storm. It's really going to be a fish storm and it will only maintain its tropical storm status probably till tomorrow morning and then become a an extra tropical system as we head into the latter parts of tomorrow and into the middle of the week. So a fish storm. It's only going to threaten the fish across the Atlantic Ocean. So that's good news. A similar track here to this system that's further south. This is Tropical Depression 10. It will likely become our next name system sometime on Tuesday and also have that similar track to Julian. So that is good news here. But it will be strengthening out over the open waters of the Atlantic east of Bermuda. Won't be a threat to the U.S., but that other system coming off the African coast could be a threat. So we'll have to watch that very carefully the next five to seven days. So we have Julian now. The next one up is Kate. That will likely be the one I showed you that's east of the Leeward Islands. And then Larry next on the list may be the one that's coming off of Africa. Stay tuned as this very active tropical season continues.